Oh, guys. After a lot of time, a lot of grinding, I had 100 axes. Y'all don't know what that means. Not that one, not that one, not that one, that one. X-Thief! Let's go! All I need is Beast. I don't have a ap Apocalypse. I don't think you can get it without it, so... This is like the one class that has amazing animations. I'm gonna go with my VIP because this is too leggy. Um, do a quick showcase. No idea what to expect. Okay. Oh man, this took so long. I used all my points on Gamba. And I got like 50 hexes from that. So that's all I did. I probably should have got, in the meantime, another mastery on something. So, X Thief. Glass Cannon plus Rush, rush Down. Okay, M1. Crazy looking. Okay, so bop, 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 bop. Bop. So every fourth hit summons those pillars. Okay. Comically large knife. Deal 15 damage by swinging your knife in front of you. After the fourth lash, it selects a random alternate move. Slash awakening five. Slash 20 times around you, dealing dealing four true damage. So that's a lot of damage. 80 damage. Yeah, yeah. 80 true damage. After one second startup, release a massive beam of energy sh from the heavens that deal 35 true damage and apply shock to targets. Slam jam. After 0 0.5 seconds of startup, slam into the ground in instantly, no matter your distance from the ground, dealing 20 damage. True. So, execute. X event. Stab forward with your blade, grabbing marked targets. All marked targets by the X event will lose 10% of their HP three times. Then 50% then 50 missing uh, HP damage. This steals the soul's target upon death. Soul Collector. You start out with five of your own souls. Upon death a soul granted grants 10 shield and, a, and one health. But shatters in the proper process. This grants temporary invulnerability. Override. Staying within the X event will change attack ability 1 and ability 2 into new moves. With separate and much longer cooldowns from their normal counterpart. This effect goes away upon cancelling or leaving the X event. I'm assuming... Yeah, that's X event. Exploding Knives. Dash... For and release 16. You know what? I'm gonna just see it first. So that one. E. Okay, that's pretty nice. It applies bleed too. Can you move the Q? That's a really short cooldown. I like that. No, you can't. Okay. I do like this uh, E ability. And then there's. Do something like this. Slashes. E. Oh, this is this one.
50 seconds. Oh my god. This class is so cool. I well worth it. I am going to play a couple of matches once I see the alternate F and M1. Uh so Wow. Okay, pressing F3 cat it casts it. So, after one second of start, summon the X event at your location. This stuns all nearby targets, deals 10 seconds, and marks them for use. Okay. Uh, overwrite. After one second of startup, tele teleport all players in the X event up in the sky, summoning knives that each deal 10 true damage. Upon telling teleporting back to the ground, deal 50 damage to each target. The storm within the center of the startup... The release of massive sphere. All damage within this will be one second K. So like you could do a combination of like this. And then maybe this. Yeah. And then you can maybe get an M1 in after no. Okay. Well, I'm gonna go hop in a public server. I love this class already. I'm definitely going to get mastery on this class. Uh, so yeah, let's hop into a public server. It looks so, so cool. Oh, man. Okay. Da, 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 da. Yeah, there is a lot of players, so it is going to be quite laggy. And obviously, this is my first time, so. Really cool class, though. Bop, bop, bop. Just so fluent. There's the beams. More beams. That's the spin. Beam. Beam. Ground pound. There we go. I'm not a huge fan of the Q ability. Oh, this is so good close range. This is crazy early. Oh, I love this class. Oh, uh, that's so good, especially in that close corners like that. That's crazy. I love this class. Oh my god. That slash is so clean.
No, I ran out of hearts. <laughs> Wait, did I kill that phantom? I think that was the phantom. A phantom tied to another phantom. I love this class. This looks amazing. This is by far my favorite class. This has to be. And you don't even need to, like, hit people. So you can just hold M1. There's no point in not. The override ability is so cool. How much damage does it do to a normal thing? Okay, so not a lot. So I don't think it's a good thing to use the click often, but maybe use the Q into the E. That's probably the most fluent and fastest way to do it. But probably if you're just looking for uh, damage, the best way is definitely the Q. The Q definitely does, sorry, the E ability definitely does the most. Unless you're going up against, like, <laughs> like, wait, does the M1 click ability have a cooldown? It does, of nine seconds. Stab. Oh, man. I wonder how it fares against a boss subway station. That clicked, like that slash. Amazing look. Uh, I do like how the it is actually, it's a really cool class. The overwrite ability, amazing, super cool. And I do like the system how you have lives and you get more lives, more kills you have. Really cool. I'm going to be honest though. Not... It's super good at the start. It's a glass cannon, after all. Like, you go up in a bunch. F ability. E. Q. They're done. But, there's the huge, huge problem of... You don't have much HP. You get one, one hit by everything. <laughs> Especially in this game. Now, I don't think it needs any changes. It's a perfect class the way it is. And just... It's so appealing. So, like... That being appealing itself... Does not need this to be changed. I really like the animation zones, though. What if- can I recall it? No, I can't. How many lives does he have? Five. So technically, you only have 100 HP. So, that's not bad HP, but it's- it's just... I don't know. I love this class. I would not be surprised if I want to main this class. It's really cool. And can prob probably be really good. I don't know if the E ability grants iframes. I would not be surprised if it does. I don't think it says also. Become invulnerable. Yes. So that makes it really good. A perfect example is there is a lot of spearmen in the server right now. Um, so y when they all evolve and use their...
I have one health left. I'm dead. I'm so dead. Ah. Uh, yeah. But I love this class. That's it.